Julianne Delorso is live in Fort Benton where the Longhorns meet the Shoto Bulldogs for one guaranteed spot in the state playoffs. Tom, these two teams have both had pretty successful seasons so far. They each only have two losses, one of those to Great Falls Central Catholic, which has been a strong team this season, and to the two teams playing in that Northern Sea interdivisional playoff game tonight, which we'll get to in just a bit. But first, the game here tonight in Fort Benton set to be a pretty even matchup. Fort Benton is 5-2 and two on the season, losing only to Great Falls Central Catholic, who was undefeated until playing belt last week, and to Centerville, which is another strong team with only one loss this season to belt. The Longhorns suffered that loss against Centerville two weeks ago and bounced back to beat Rocky Boy 77-20 last week. Shoto, also 5-2, and two, was an early favorite this season. They fell in week four to the team that then emerged as a leader, Great Falls Central Catholic, and then they lost to Belt in week five. Since then, in the past two weeks, they've only let up six points while scoring 136. Now onto that Northern Sea Championship between Belt and Centerville. These two teams met early in the season in week two. It's the closest game that the undefeated Huskies have played in all season. Centerville hung tight with Belt and kept the score tied into the fourth quarter before Keegan Stroop found the end zone with just two minutes and 29 seconds remaining in that game. Belt also took down Great Falls Central last week. Centerville has only lost that one time to Belt and they've now had time to improve and prepare for the Huskies again. Safe to say the Miners will be vying for revenge, but Belt isn't slowing down. So really anybody's game tonight and both are expected to be a fight to the finish. Of course, Belt and Centerville already locked up their playoff spots and the winner here tonight in Fort Benton will join them in the postseason. We're live in Fort Benton. I'm Julianne Delorso for MTN Sports. Tom, back to you.